Which of the following legal entities are generally classified as C corporations for tax purposes? We have five choices limited liability companies, S corporations, limited partnerships, sole proprietorships, or none of the choices are correct. The correct answer is none of the choices are correct. Limited liability companies and limited partnerships are generally taxed as partnerships. S corporations are taxed under a separate set of rules applicable to S corporations. An S corporation is not a legal entity. Sole proprietorships are not taxed separately from their owners. Which of the following statements is false for a C corporation that incurred a net operating loss for a tax year ending in 2017? And we've got four choices. The first choice says, if it carries back the NOL and or carries it forward, it may offset up to 80% of the taxable income before the NOL deduction in those years. The second choice says it may carry the NOL forward for up to 20 years and offset up to 100% of the taxable income before the NOL deduction in those years. The third option says it may carry the NOL back two years and offset up to 100% of the taxable income before the NOL deduction in those years. And the fourth option is none of these. Selecting this option means you believe all of the other responses are true. Okay, and now we see that the first choice was correct. And the first choice said, if it carries back the net operating loss and or carries it forward, it may offset up to 80% of the taxable income before the NOL deduction in those years. Now, for tax years beginning before 2018, C corporations can offset up to 100% of taxable income before the NOL deduction. When an employee shareholder receives a business income allocation from an S corporation, what taxes apply to the business income allocation? Our choices are FICA tax only, self-employment tax only, FICA and self-employment tax, regular income tax, or none of the choices are correct. Regular income tax is the correct response here. An S corporation employee shareholder must pay FICA tax on any salary received from an S corporation. However, any S corporation ordinary business income allocated to them is not subject to either FICA or self-employment tax. Rather, it will only be subject to the regular income tax at the shareholder's marginal ordinary income tax rate. Assume you plan to start a new enterprise. You know the probability of having losses for the first three years of operations is almost 90% and you know that you will report a substantial amount of income from other sources during those same three years. From a tax perspective, which of the following entity choices would not allow you to offset the entity losses against your income from other sources? A C corporation, an LLC, a general partnership, or an S corporation? The, co the correct response is the C corporation. A C corporation's losses must be used at the entity level. That is, the losses don't flow through to owners to offset their income from other sources.